What is up guys, Dezo here, and today I'm going to be talking about the 1.04 patch notes. This is the biggest patch for Black Ops 3 yet, and they did some really cool stuff with it. A link to these patch notes will be down in the description if you want to read them yourself. So the first thing you'll notice when you get on Black Ops 3 is that there will be a quick join option to join your friend's session quickly. It's a pretty cool thing, uh, I don't know if it's really needed because they already have the friends thing, but it's something different. The next big thing is that you will be able to see your most recent black market items that you unlocked. You can see your most recent 25. You can't really do anything with them, but you can definitely just check them out and see what you got. Another big thing about this update is that you can burn black market items for crypto keys. I'm pretty sure it's one crypto key per one item. I burned 51 before this video, I burned 2 in this video, so just a demonstration of what it can do. It's pretty cool, so that way you don't need to have the duplicate ones and you actually get crypto keys back. They added new secondary weapons which are unlocked via the black market, which are the wrench, the butterfly knife, and brass knuckles. They added arena probation, and the coolest part about this update is they added 1000 levels to master prestige. Once you go past 55, your rank turns orange. You will also be able to choose any prestige emblem from this game once you're past level 55. Then once you get to level 100 and so on every 100 levels, you will be able to choose more prestige emblems from World at War, Black Ops 1, and Black Ops 2. For example, once you hit level 100, you will be able to choose a first prestige icon from World at War, Black Ops 1, or Black Ops 2, or any from this game so on and so forth. So 800, you'll get World at War, Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, 8th Prestige. And once you hit level 1000, you'll get World at War's 10th Prestige, Black Ops 1, and Black Ops 2. You'll also get 11th through 15th Prestige on Black Ops 1, and Master Prestige from Black Ops 2. So please leave a comment below telling me what you think about this update. You like it, you don't like it, you think there's way too many levels, you don't think there's enough levels. Stuff like that. And if you liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe for more videos every other day.